Pastor Will Abar here from Come Connect Church. We are so excited to have you with us this morning. We pray that you enjoy the message that is coming next. God bless you. We are in a series called the sower, sembrador, the seed, la semilla, and the soil. Y, y la, la tierra. How many have been blessed so far? ¿Cuántos están bendecido? Come on, you can give him a clap offering. Dale un aplauso al Señor. How many people are, are in our men's group and women's group? Raise your hand. ¿Cuánta gente está en nuestra, nuestro grupo de hombres y mujeres? How many are not? Raise your hand. ¿Cuántos no están? You need to be involved in that. Que Before you leave, please receive a link. Antes que te vayas, por favor, recibe este link. It's a Zoom link every Thursday night. Es un link de Zoom. The women get together. Que lo, la mujeres se juntan los jueves. And the last thing I heard, y lo último que, it was que about oí, 33 women. Que habían 33 mujeres. And there was a fire preacher y había un on poder the line. Del Señor. Teaching the word of God. And so we had 33 women on fire so teníamos 33 on a Thursday night en jueves, ready for Sunday. Esperando el, el domingo. Man, I'm coming too. Yo voy a ir también. Because <laughs> we might have not had 33 men. Nosotros quizá no teníamos 33 mujeres. But we had 20 something. Pero teníamos 22 and we praise the Lord hombres. for that. Y le damos gracias al Señor por eso. And there was a fire preacher on that too. Y había un predicador encendido and brought the día. fire of the word. Y trajo el, el fuego de, de, and there were so la many men lit on fire that night. Y había tantos hombres encendido por, con el poder and de we Dios. meet on Tuesday nights at 7 p.m. Y nos encontramos y nos juntamos en los martes so in these, a las 7. So in these connect groups, if you will. En estos grupos, we have different people from our church. Tenemos diferentes personas de nuestra iglesia. Being trained up. Teaching the word of God. Enseñando la palabra de Dios. That's growth. Eso es crecimiento. That's growth. Eso Amen. Es Amen. Amen. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's uh, let's let's read the word. Chap Matthew chapter thirteen. I'm going to begin reading at verse three. Vamos a leer la palabra Mateo trece. All right. Behold, the sower went out to sow, and he sowed and. And as he sowed, some fell by the wayside, and the birds came and devoured them. Y, y, y les dijo la parábola muchos muchas cosas como esta. Un sembrador salió a sembrar mientras iba eh, esparciendo la semilla. Una parte cayó junto al camino y llegaron los pájaros y se la comieron. Some fell on stony places where they did not have much earth, and it, and immediately sprang up. But because they had no depth on the earth, go ahead. Otra parte cayó en terreno pedregoso, sin mucha tierra. When the sun came up, it withered and it was scorched because they had no root. Esa semilla brotó pronto porque la tierra no era profunda, pero cuando salió el sol, las plantas se marchitaron y, y, y por no tener raíz se secaron. Some fell among thorns, and the thorns sprang up and choked them. Otras partes de la semilla cayó entre espinos que al creer la ahogaron. 
But others fell on good ground and yielded a crop of a hundred, some sixty, and some thirtyfold. Pero las otras semillas cayeron en buen terreno, en el que se se dio una cosecha que rindió tre, tre, treinta, se, se, sesenta y hasta cien veces más de lo que se había sembrado. Skip down to verse eighteen. Therefore, hear the parable of the sower. When anyone hears the word of the kingdom, say kingdom, and does not understand it, then the wicked one comes and snatches it away, that which was sown in his heart. Escuchar lo que significa la parábola del sembrador. Cuando alguien oye la, pa la palabra cerca del reino, diga reino, y, lo, y no le, le entienda, Viene el maligno y arrebata lo que sembró en su corazón. Father, we thank you, we bless you, we ask God that your word may penetrate our hearts, that it may receive, that it may be good ground. Father, I pray for every heart represented in this place, every heart listening on Zoom, every heart on social media. Right now, God, I pray, God, that you uh, may plant the seed and that we may receive exactly what that seed is, oh God, and that in due time, Lord, that it may bring forth a harvest, some hundredfold, some thirtyfold, and some uh, sixtyfold. Father, we pray that you may hide your servant behind the cross, that we may be able to preach and convey your message in the most simplest form possible, Lord. We thank you for your word, which is the word of God, and we thank you, God, for having us here today. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Amen. All right, so we're in the parable of the sower. Estamos en la parábola de, del sembrador. So, uh, what is the parable of the sower? ¿Qué es la, palabra, la parábola del sembrador? This is my interpretation of this. Esto, esto es lo que yo entiendo. The interpretation that I have la is that que this tengo. is the parable of the kingdom. Esta es la parábola del reino. The message el mensaje is the kingdom. Es el reino. That's the message. Es, es el mensaje. That is the seed. Esa es la semilla. That Jesus is trying to convey. Que Jesús quiere traer. And trying to plant. Y quiere sembrar. He's, he wants to plant the kingdom. Él quiere, eh, él quiere plantar el reino. And so we have learned. Que, que hemos aprendido. The foundation of the sower, the la, seed, and the soil. La fundación del sembrador, la semilla y el sembrador. Y el, we, el sembrador. we also focus on the seed. También nos enfocamos en la semilla. The fact that God places a seed inside of a seed. La, lo, lo que Dios, Dios planta en la semilla sobre la semilla. And then we focused a little bit on the kingdom. Y nos enfocamos en, la, en el reino. And the message. Y en el mensaje. And so we said that the kingdom. Decimos que el, el reino. It means dominion. Se, 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 significa dominio. A kingdom is a realm. Eso mismo. A kingdom is a government. Un reino es un gobierno. It is a territory. Es un terreno. It is a land. Es una tierra. It's a country. Es un país. And so, what was, the, what was Jesus' message? ¿Cuál fue el mensaje de, de, Dios, de Jesús? If you go throughout the Gospels, si vas en, 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 en el Evangelio, His message, en su mensaje, everywhere He went, todo, a, todo aquel donde fue, was the kingdom. Fue el reino. If you look at the message, the, 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 the Sermon on the Mount, it was the biggest message he ever preached. Fue el mensaje más grande que, que predicó. Go back in there. Ve ahí. Matthew chapter 5. Mateo capítulo cinco. The message that he was re replying el mensaje or que, relaying el, el mensaje que tra que trajo was the kingdom message. Fue el mensaje del reino. It was the message of the kingdom. El mensaje del, del reino. I can't move on until I, I, I put this in, in place. So it's going to take some time. That's why I have to teach, okay? What was the message of John the Baptist? ¿Cuál fue el mensaje de, de Juan el Bautista? Come on, y'all. Repent for Arrep what? Arrepiéntense. El reino de Dios. Some people think that the message of John the Baptist was Jesus. Algunos creen que el mensaje de, de Juan el Bautista fue Jesús. It was. Sí fue. 
But the message was the kingdom. Fue el reino. What, what, it was what Jesus was bringing here onto earth. Fue lo que Jesús trajo a, a, the message a la of John the Baptist el de Juan el was Bautista, that the kingdom of God que el reino de Dios was near. Okay, let me just read it to you because y'all want to just show I got to give you evidence. Matthew chapter 3, you don't got to go there if you're taking notes. Matthew chapter 3 verse 1 says this. John the Baptist came preaching in the wilderness of Judea saying, repent because the kingdom of heaven is near. Dice, en aquellos días se presentó Juan el Bautista predicando en el desierto de Judea y decía, arrepentíos, porque el reino de, de los cielos está cerca. Why am I preaching the kingdom? ¿Por qué estoy predicando del reino? Because we won't understand the whole story. Porque no vamos a entender la historia completa. If we don't understand the message inside of the story. Si no entendemos el mensaje adentro del de The historia, message inside of the story. El mensaje adentro de la historia. Is the kingdom. Es el reino. The message of Jesus el mensaje de Jesús was always the kingdom. Fue siempre el reino. Matthew chapter 4 verse 23. Mateo capítulo 4 versículo 23. Now Jesus began to go all over Galilee teaching in their synagogues, preaching the good news of the kingdom and healing every disease and sickness among the people. Jesús recogía toda Galilea enseñando en las sinagogas anunciando las buenas nuevas del reino y sanando toda enfermedad y dolencias entre la gente. Jesus went all over preaching the kingdom. Jesús fue a toda parte predicando el reino. The disciples came reino. to Jesus and asked him a question. Los discípulos vinieron, vinieron a Jesús y le preguntaron. He said, Rabbi, él le dijo, Rabbi, how do we pray? ¿Cómo oramos? And Jesus said these words. Y Jesús le dijo esta palabra. When you pray. Cuando oras. Matthew chapter 6 verse 10. Mateo capítulo 6 versículo 10. Pray like 10. this. Your kingdom comes. Que tu reino venga. Your will be done. Que tu, que, que on earth. Tu en la as tierra, it is in heaven. Como en el cielo. He was talking about a kingdom. Él de un reino coming onto earth. Viniendo a, a la tierra. Matthew chapter 6 verse 33 says this. Mateo capítulo 5, capítulo, eh, capítulo I hear a lot of people 33. quote this scripture. Mucha gente dicen esta, esta versículo. Seek first Jesus. Buscar a Jesús. He says, seek first the kingdom of God. Él dice, buscar el re, primeramente el reino de Dios. And his righteousness. Y su justicia. And everything else will be added on to you. Y toda la cosa se, será añadida. The message of Jesus was. El, el mensaje de Jesús es. All you have to do is. Solo, solo tiene que hacer es Seek the kingdom of God buscar el reino. and everything that you've been looking for y todo lo que estaba buscando is in the kingdom. Está en el reino. Everything that you've been looking for todo lo que está buscando everything that you've been working towards todo, todo lo que está caminando is found in the very kingdom está dentro del reino. that Jesus was trying to implement here on earth. Que Jesús quiere implementar en la and tierra. so what's the message? ¿Y cuál es el mensaje? It's the kingdom. Es el reino. The kingdom is the message. El, el mensaje es el Matthew reino. chapter 12 verse 26 Mateo Capítulo 12 says this seis, dice, Satan drives out Satan, he is divided against himself. How then will the kingdom stand? And if I drive out demons by Beelzebub, by whom your sons drive them out, for this reason they will be your judges. Verse 28 If I drive out demons by the Spirit of God, then what? Then the kingdom of God has come upon you. Y si Satanás expulsa a Satanás, está dividido contra sí mismo. ¿Cómo puede entonces mantenerse en pie su reino? Ahora bien, si yo expulso lo, los demonios por medio de Be de Bezebú. Yep. The evidence. La evidencia. Of a kingdom. De un reino. Approaching acercándose. is the presence of another kingdom existing. Es la evidencia de otro reino que existe. Watch this. Deliverance. De liberación. Is a clear picture. Es un, es una imagen claro. That the kingdom of heaven exists. Que el reino de los cielos existe. Religion. La religión will always shun out deliverance. 
echas atrás la, la, la liberación because they don't understand porque no entiende kingdom principles los principios del reino they don't understand no van a entender the message of the kingdom el mensaje del reino Jesus goes on to say Jesús dice to the religious leaders a los religiosos as he líderes, delivers a man que, que deja hacer libre un hombre from demonic oppression por, por la opresión demoníaca the religious people los religiosos say dicen you cast out these demons tú, tú echas los demonios on the name of Beelzebub en el nombre de Bezabú, another demon otro demonio and Jesus says y Jesús dice there's no way I can do that que no hay manera que puedo hacer because eso, the kingdom divided against itself porque un reino dividido en sí mismo stand. no puede so eh, I'm pararse. coming so yo vengo under the authority la of a whole other kingdom otro reino. and when the kingdom of darkness y is present y el reino de and there is deliverance viena, that takes place y libertad, that is a clarity que hay una, una imagen claro, that the kingdom of heaven is right here que el, el, el reino de los cielos está aquí. Hallelujah. oh you don't believe me let me give you some more scripture no me crees. Dame, date más Matthew chapter 11 Mateo verse 12, 12. Capítulo 11, versículo From the days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven suffers violence, and the violence take it by force. For all the prophets and the law prophesied until John. And if you're willing to accept it, he is the Elijah who is to come. Let everyone who has ears listen. Desde los días de Juan el Bautista hasta ahora, Reina de los Cielos ha venido avanzado contra viento y marea y los que esfuerzan logran a, aferrarse a él porque todos los profetas y la ley profetizaron hasta Juan y si queréis aceptar mi palabra Juan es el Elías que había de venir el que tenga oídos que oiga I'm, just, I'm trying to get it out From the days of John the Baptist until now, Desde los días de Juan el Bautista hasta ahora, the kingdom of heaven has suffered violence. El reino de los cielos ha, ha, ha experimentado vientos y marea. And violence take it by force. Y lo violento lo arrebata. That's why we don't ask permission. Por eso no pedimos permiso. When a demonic spirit shows up. Cuando un, una presencia demoníaca en, Because when en, a kingdom invades another kingdom. Cuando un reino se, se, co, Conquista otro it does reino. not knock on the door no le toca la and say, can we come in? No le pide permiso. It is taking the territory le está tomando el territorio by violence and force. Por violencia y fuerza. In other words, en, en otra palabra, you can't fight a kingdom tú no puedes pelear un reino unless you have another kingdom present. Si no tienes una presencia Kingdoms de otro reino. against kingdom fight each reino other. Contra reino pelean contra, entre sí mismo. And so when there's a demonic kingdom, Entonces, un, un, un reino demoníaco, there has to be another kingdom present. Tiene que haber otro reino in order to drive out that kingdom para, para echar ese otro oh reino. you guys ain't saying nothing no están diciendo nada no están entendiendo and so what's the message ¿Cuál es el mensaje? the kingdom of God el reino de Dios. is the message es el mensaje. but today I want to focus on something very simple Pero hoy me quiero enfoca, eh, enfocar en otra cosa simple. today I want to focus on the soil quiero, eh, en, quiero enfocarme en la tierra let me focus on the soil real quick. En la tierra quiero enfocarme. Jesus is teaching us Jesús no está enseñando that there are four types of soils. Que hay diferentes tipos de, de, de tierra. The wayside soil. La tierra wayside. Wayside. La tierra wayside. The rocky soil. La, la tierra con piedras. The thorny soil. Y la tierra con espina. And then there's good soil. Y hay la tierra fértil. So this, is, this tells me this. Esto me dice algo. If there's four people in your aisle right now, si hay cuatro personas go ahead look tu, at them. En tu línea, go ahead look at them. Míralos. One of you, uno, uno de ellos, is the wayside. Es una tierra plana. Go ahead look, look behind you too. One of you is thorny soil. Otro, otro, otro tiene la tierra con espina. One of you is rocky soil. Otro tiene la, la piedra con piedras. One of you is good soil. 
Otra tiene la, la, la tierra buena. If the person next to you is like this, si la, si la persona al lado de ti está, they the wayside soil. <laughs> tiene la tierra plana. Right. So, so what is this saying? ¿Qué está diciendo esto? It's painting a picture of the church. Está pintando la imagen de la iglesia. It's painting a picture of the church. Está pintando la imagen de la iglesia. In the church, en la iglesia, there are four types of people. Hay cuatro tipos de personas. There are people, hay gente that are wayside. Que hay que son planas. There are people that are rocky. Son hay gente que there's que people that are thorny. Hay gente con espinas. And then there's people that are good soil. Y hay gente que tiene la la tierra buena. And so if you if you want to subtitle the message, si quiere darle un título al mensaje, we're gonna for the rest of our time, por el resto del tiempo, break down the wayside soil. Vamos a a a traer los puntos de de la tierra plana. I want you to understand that all soils, toda la tierra, have two common elements. Tiene dos elementos. They have the they have the same sower. Tiene la misma tierra. And they have the same seed. Y tiene la, la misma semilla. The sower and the seed does not change. El, el sembrador y la semilla no cambian. So we all get the same. Todo es lo mismo. We all have the same farmer. Tenemos el mismo sembrador. And we all have the same farmer sowing the same seed. Y tenemos el mismo sembrador sembrando la misma semilla. Can we all agree to that? Podemos estar de acuerdo en eso. It's not the sower. No es el sembrador. That is the issue. Que que tiene el problema. It's not even the seed. No es la semilla que tiene el problema. That's the problem. Que tiene problema. I'm going to tell you why it's not the seed. Te voy a decir por qué no es la semilla. Because for thousands of years, por muchos años, this seed, esta semilla, this same message, este mismo mensaje, has been delivering people, he estado out of depression, liberando gente de depresión. This same seed, esa misma semilla, has been coming into ha venido people's lives en la vida de and removing personas. anxiety from them. Y de, y, y removiendo ansiedad. Delivering people from drug addiction. Liberando gente de, de, de las drogas. Delivering people from demonic activities. De, de presencia demoníaca. The same seed. Esa misma semilla. Has been changing people's mindsets. Ha, ha estado cambiando la mente de la persona. Has been restoring broken homes. Ha estado restaurando hogares. Has been restoring marriages and, re, and relationships. Restaurando relaciones y matrimonios. The word of God. La palabra the de message Dios, of the kingdom el mensaje del reino, has impacted people ha impactado la personas, that have been torn up from the flow up que, que ha estado corrompido. that have been <laughs> can I say that? say, say I that say torn up from the flow up yeah. torn up from the flow up corrompidos busted and disgusted corrompidos people that have been enslaved que, que ha estado captivados to sin al, al this very word Esta misma palabra has set them free. Lo ha, lo ha liberado. So it's not the seed. No es la semilla. It's not the sower. No es la, el because sembrador. the seed has power. Porque la semilla I tiene said poder. the seed has power. Es, la semilla tiene poder. And once the seed is planted, y cuando la semilla está that sembrada, very power ese mismo poder, then is, un, is unfolded. Eh, ha, ha, sta, ha estado and manifested y se ha manifestado in your life en tu vida. once the seed hits you Cuando la semilla te toca, your life is transformed tu vida es transformada. what says if your life is not changing si tu vida no está cambiando, if you're not growing si no estás creciendo, it's not the sower no es el sembrador, it's not the seed no es la, la semilla, my friends eh, tu amigos, my brothers hermanos, my sisters hermanas, it's the soil es, eh, la, la tierra it's the soil. If you have not been transformed, no ha sido transformado. It's because you have not experienced. Es porque no no ha experimentado the kingdom, el reino of the power of that seed, del poder de esa semilla. The wayside soil. Tell the person next to you, wayside soil. La tierra plana. Wayside soil. Wayside soil. Tierra <laughs> plana. Tell the person next to you that ain't me. Eso, dile a la persona al lado de ti, eso no soy yo. <laughs> and so what do we know? What do we know about the wayside? ¿Qué sabemos de, de la tierra plana? Point number one. Punto número uno. Verse 18 says, Versículo 18. Therefore, hear the parable of the Lord. When anyone hears, tell the person next to you, hears the word of the kingdom. Escuchar lo que significa la parábola del sembrador. 
cuando alguien oye la palabra acerca del reino y, y no la entiende, viene el maligno. Say oye. O, hear. Say hear. Say oye. Say hear. So that means you can hear. Es, that, If you hear me, say amen. Si me oyes, dice amen. Scripture says that the wayside soil dice que la, la, la tierra plana they hear. Oye. They hear what? Oyen qué? They hear the same message. Oye el mismo mensaje. Every other soil you hears. Que toda otra tierra escucha. So we know that church folks hear. Sabemos que la iglesia, lo, los hermanos de la iglesia. They have been exposed to truth. Ha estado expuesto a la verdad. I know that. Lo sé. Because I come across people. Porque me enfrento con gente. That are just toe up. Que, que están cremantado. And quote more scripture than I know. Y se saben la palabra más que, que, que yo. So they have heard the word. Ellos han oído la palabra. Some even memorize the word. Algunos también lo memorizan la palabra. But something happened in between. Pero algo ocurrió en el, en el medio. So we know that the wayside soil hears. Sabemos que la tierra plana escucha. Second thing we know is that the word says that the seed was sown. Sabemos también que la semilla está sembrada. It was sown. Fue sembrada. So the wayside soil la tierra plana have received the seed. Ha recibido la, la semilla. But scripture says that the birds come in and devour it. Dicen que la, la palabra que lo, los pájaros vienen y, y lo devoran. It is taken away. Ha, ha quitado. Wayside soil. La tierra plana. Even though they receive. Aunque lo re recibieron. They don't believe. No creen. They can sit in church. Consideran la iglesia. Hear the same message you hear. La, el mismo mensaje que oyes. And they will say it's not for me, it's for somebody else. Dicen que no es para mí, es para otro. Or, they don't agree with it. O, o no van a de, de acuerdo. Because of the current lifestyle that they're living. Por la vida que, que ellos viven. Wayside soil. And because of that, <coughs> por eso. the devil somehow has convinced them El enemigo lo convence. that what they're hearing lo que está escuchando is not for them. No es para ellos. Now, I like the way Luke puts it. You don't have to go there. Luke chapter 8. Verse 4 says this, and when a great multitude had gathered, uh, they had come to him from every city. And he spoke these parables. The soil went out to sow his seed, and he sowed it. And some fell on the wayside and was trampled down. And the birds came and devoured it. De cada pueblo salía gente para ver a Jesús. Chapter 8, verse 4. De cada pueblo salía gente para ver a Jesús y cuando se reunió una gran multitud les, di, les contó esta palabra. Un sembrador salió a sembrar, al par, a par, parcir la semilla, una parte cayó junto al camino, fue pisoteada y los pájaros se la comieron. So the only way you can trample something is if you step on it. Una, la, la única manera que, que tú puedes eh, tropezar es cuando tú pisas algo. So that tells me that the wayside significa que el, la tierra plana is a path. Es un camino. And where people come cuando la gente, donde la gente viene and walk by y pasa and they step on it. Y, y lo pisan. You can't tell me, no me puede decir. who you hang with is not important. Say that again. Say that again. You can't tell me the environment you put yourself in is not important. No, no me puede decir que el, 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 el lugar donde estás no es importante. Because the people you hang around with donde, con quien tú andas, the environment you put yourself around in donde tú te rodeas, will then come in 
viene and trample y te the very seed la that God has planted que, que el, for your life. Que Dios ha and en by tu the vida. time you notice, y tú the te enemy cuenta, now el has come in ha and stolen y, y the very thing la, la that God intended que Dios for you to grow in. Para tu crecer. It is taken away. Lo ha arrebatado. It's not about being religious. No es, no es ser religioso. I'm not hanging with this group. No es hangar con este 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 grupo de personas. Because we're better. Porque somos mejor. No, the scripture says everyone falls what short. We're all in the same category. Todo el mundo estamos en el mismo lugar. But watch this. They call Jesus a friend of what? Sinners. Oh, Y'all ready? ¿Están listo? Our responsibility nuestra responsabilidad is not to go in no es ir and blend in. Y, y estar juntos. Our responsibility nuestra responsabilidad is to go in es entrar and impact y the very environment el, el, that we put ourselves in. Donde estamos. Let me give you a revelation. Dame date una revelación. Watch this. Jesus didn't come Jesús no vino to blend in. Para, para ser igual Jesus didn't come Jesús no vino and hung out y a with the church folks, con, con los, con with the religious iglesia, leaders. Con los Jesus came Jesús vino and put himself in an environment, y se puso en un, but he impacted en un the very environment donde that he would put himself en in lugar there. Donde estaba. Because wherever the kingdom of God Cuando el reino de Dios goes, va, it will impact. It will impact. If you're around me, si estás alrededor de mí, I promise you, te prometo, you will be impacted. Tú vas a estar impactado. And I'm going to tell you why. Te diré por qué. It's because my environment es porque lo que me rodea controls me. me. Me controla. Where I put myself donde yo me pongo, is very important. Es, es bien importante. And so I might be out in the community, si voy a estar en la comunidad, but I want you to understand pero quiero que entendas, that when I, when I show up, Cuando vengo, the kingdom of God is with me. El reino de Dios está and so conmigo. watch this. And so that means Eso that you have to change the way you speak around me. Que tienes que cambiar cómo that hablas means you have to change the way you behave around me. Tienes que cambiar cómo tú te comportas you don't have to leave. No puedes irte. But no I'm going to remove myself Pero yo me voy from a this place. Because what? ¿Por qué? Your wayside. Porque eres tierra plana. Wayside. Tierra plana. You good? Time? I'm, I'm thinking I'm going long. All right, I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Keep going. Another translation that I love is otra, this. Otra traducción que, que me gusta. Mark chapter 4, verse 15. I love the way Mark puts it. He says, and these are the ones that fell by the wayside when the word was sown. When they hear, Satan comes immediately and takes it away the word that was sown in their what? In their hearts. Go ahead. Algunos son como la, los, como los sembrado, como los sembró junto al camino donde se, sem, se sembra, donde se siembra la palabra. Tan pronto como la oyen, Viene Satanás y le quita la palabra sembrada en ellos. Go ahead and you can put this. I'm, I'm closing. The moment the seed is sown. El momento que la semilla es, es sembrada. And is on the wayside. Y está en la tierra plana. Satan comes in. Satanás viene. And steals the very word. Y te arrebata la misma palabra. That was sown into your hearts. Que fue sembrada en tu corazón. We gotta ask a question in that. In that, we gotta ask a question. Hay que preguntar la pregunta. Why does he come immediately? Por qué viene inmediatamente? Lest that seed takes root. Pues si la semilla coge, coge. Right. Lest that seed takes root. Raíces, coge raíces. And then scripture says, and then you're saved. Entonces estás salvo. The enemy doesn't want you El no to grow. Que 
He's okay with you coming to church every Sunday. Él está bien con tú venir todos los domingos. As long as you don't step into the kingdom message. Si tú no, si tú no entras en el mensaje del reino. You're okay. Todo está bien. Anytime the kingdom arrives, cuando el, el reino de, de, de Dios viene, there's transformation. Hay transformación. If you're not transformed, si no está transformado, it's because you have not understood the kingdom. Es porque no ha entendido el reino. When you receive the kingdom, tú recibes el reino, you understand the kingdom. Tú entiendes el reino. Watch this. It's like, it's like when Liz was saying, Lord, you was pursuing me. Como Liz decía que tú, Dios, tú me estabas persiguiendo But no mí. more, I'm going to pursue you ella from dijo, this point no, forward. Ella dijo, no más, yo te voy a perseguir a ti de ahora adelante. The kingdom is like this. El reino es así. It's like a treasure. Es como un tesoro. That when you find it, es cuando tú le encuentras, you go and sell everything you have. Tú vendes todos. And you grab that very treasure that you found. Y tú, y tú agarras ese, ese Because tesoro. the most important thing Lo más importante is the kingdom es el reino that you found. Que tú encontraste. In conclusion, en conclusión, the wayside soil la tierra plana is always learning, siempre está aprendiendo, but never coming to the knowledge of the truth. Pero no viene a, al conocimiento de la verdad. Second Timothy, segundo de Timoteo, chapter three, Versículo chapter tres. three, Second Timothy. And so watch this. The wayside soil will not change. La tierra plana no va a cambiar. I heard people say, well, there's dirt underneath that rock, that, that, that path. Hay tierra en ese camino, debajo de ese camino. It might be dirt. Sí, hay, hay tierra. But if you're on the path of a wayside, Pero si tú estás en el camino de la tierra plana, the purpose for the wayside is that very thing. El propósito de la tierra plana es la misma cosa. It's the wayside. Es la tierra plana. The wayside would never grow on the wayside. The seed would never grow on the wayside. La semilla nunca va a crecer en, en, tierra, en la tierra plana. So, Pastor Will, how do I land this plane? ¿Cómo aterrizo este avión? This is what the Lord revealed to me. Esto es lo que Dios me reveló. In order for you to become good ground, good la, soil, la única manera que tú te puedes convertir en tierra buena, en tierra fértil, is you have to do three things. Tiene que hacer tres cosas. Number one is you have to change positions. Tiene que cambiar de posición. You can't expect to be on the wayside. Tú no puedes, tú no puedes eh, estar en la tierra plana. And expect to grow. Y crecer. And change. Y cambiar. So you have to move your position. Tiene que cambiar tu posición. From the wayside. De la tierra plana. To the good soil. Para la tierra buena. Second thing is this: once you change your position, cuando tú cambias tu posición, what is changing your position? ¿Qué es cambiar tu posición? Changing your mind. Cambiando tu mente, renovando tu mente. A lot of people think they want to. Uh, uh, um, you will. You you will get a different outcome doing the same things. Algunas personas creen que va 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 a ser algo diferente. You have to si change the position. Tiene que cambiar la posición. So you can receive a different outcome. Para tener otro resultado. The second thing that comes with it is this. La segunda cosa que viene. Once you change your position, ahí cuando tú cambias tu posición, you will change the conditions. Tú cambias tu condición. And once the condition is changed, Cuando la condición cambia, what changes the, the condition? What changes it, y'all? ¿Qué cambia la condición? La, la, la the condición. seed. La semilla. Now the seed has room Ahora la semilla tiene espacio to do what it was meant to do. Para hacer lo que, lo que tiene el propósito de hacer. Seed has one responsibility. La semilla tiene una responsabilidad. Grow. Y es crecer. When put cuando se está puesta in the right climate en el, en, en el clima in the right buena, environment en el lugar mejor and given the necessary nourishment that it needs y dándole el tratamiento que necesita para crecer once you change your position ahí cuando tú cambias tu posición it changes your conditions cambia tu condición and then thirdly y tercermente it changes the outcome cambia la, 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 el resultado you move 
mueve from wayside de la tierra plana to good ground a, a la tierra fértil la tierra plana to good ground now look at the person next to you mira la persona al lado de ti and say i told you i was in the wayside yo te dile te dije que yo no era tierra plana i'm good ground Go ahead and fértil. tell them that. Yo I'm fértil. good ground. Yo I am good ground. Yo buena. And the seed y la that the sower is sowing, y que la, que el está sembrando, I'm going to receive it. Yo lo voy a and in due time, y en tiempo, it will grow. Va a it will take root. Va, va a I raíz. will change my position. Voy a mi I will change my condition. Voy a mi and I will have a different outcome. Y voy a tener un resultado mejor. Because ¿Por qué? I am ¿Por qué? good ground. Porque estoy, my porque time estoy is fertile. And I thank you for yours. Amen. We're going to have the daughter of the house here, Jasmine. God, it looks different from up here. <laughs> Está diferente de, de aquí. Um, that word is, it was so powerful. Esa palabra fue tan maravillosa. And it's going to tie into the tithes and offerings. Y, y va a ir junto con, con la, los diezmos y las ofrendas. So you know how you guys test God in your life? Tú sabes cómo tú eh, pruebas a Dios en tu vida. You say, Lord, like that woman that was sitting here, she said, Lord, if I'm supposed to be here. You need to speak to me. Como la la señora que estaba aquí en adelante, tú le dices, señor, si tú si yo estoy aquí, hago conmigo. The same thing the Lord is asking you to test Him in your tithes and offerings. Así mismo, Dios te está probando en los diezmos y la ofrenda. Giving our tithes and offerings reflects a grateful heart that wants to give back to God. Dando nuestro dar nuestros diezmos y ofrendas. Refleja un corazón agradecido que, que quiere devolverle a Dios. A portion of what he has given us. Una porción de lo que él nos ha dado a nosotros. And in reality, what is already his. Y, en, eh, y realmente lo que le pertenece a él. This is our opportunity. Esta es nuestra oportunidad. To show God. Enseñarle a Dios. That he is first in our lives. Que él es primero en, nuestro, en nuestras vidas. If we go to Deuteronomy 14:23, si vamos a Deuteronomio 14, 23, and the word of God says, y la palabra de Dios dice, eat the tithe of your grain, new wine and olive oil, and the firstborn of your herds and flocks in the presence of the Lord your God at the place He will clothe, He will choose as a dwelling for His name. So that you may learn to revere the Lord your God always. En la presencia del Señor, tu, tu Dios, comerás la, la diezma, parte de tu trigo, tu vino nuevo y tu aceite, y de los primogénitos de tu vaca y ovejas. Lo, los hará en el lugar que le, que le escoja como residencia de su nombre. The Bible says... La palabra dice, the purpose of tithing el propósito del, del diezmo, is to teach you always es, es, es to put God first in your life. De poner a Dios primero en tu corazón, en tu vida. Tithing is a reminder el diezmo es un recordatorio that God is the supplier of everything we have. Que Dios es el suplidor de todo lo que tenemos. It is also God's personal invitation. Es, es la invitación personal de Dios. To an outpouring of his blessing in your life. De, de, de un derrame de, de su bendición en tu vida. This morning, God reminded me. Esta mañana, Dios me, me recordó. Of when I first came to God. Cuando primero vine a, a Dios. And I remember learning to tithe. Y, y uh, me recordé de primero dando mi, mi diezmo. When I was in my early 20s. Cuando estaba en, en, en mis 20s. And I understood. Y cuando, y entendí. That giving my 10% to God of my wages. Que dándole 10% de, de mis ganancias. Is putting God first in my life. Es poniendo Dios primero en mi vida. So I said, Lord. Le dije, Dios. I give you my tuition in your hands. Le doy te doy mi, mi gasto de la escuela. My expenses for me to just live. Mis gastos de, de vivir. 
And as I started giving God my tithes, y cuando, y cuando le di mis a Dios, I started seeing that I pretty much never lacked anything. And when I say pretty much, y, y cuando digo casi mente, it's because there were times that I didn't tithe. Era porque a veces no daba mi diezmo. And I can feel already that God was like not having my back a little bit. Y sentía cuando que yo no me respaldaba en ese momento. So that was God reminding me. Pero eso fue Dios recordándome. That everything that I have belongs to Him. Que todo lo que tengo le pertenece a él. So He's only asking me. Solo me está me me está pidiendo. To show an act of. Que enseñe un acto. Remembrance that it, I have to give it back to him. So I'm now in my late 30s and I am so blessed. I don't lack anything. No me falta nada. I may not have a lot of money. No tengo mucho dinero. But I don't like anything. Pero no not me falta everything nada. is monetary. No, no es todo es dinero. God has blessed me with a beautiful, healthy family. Dios me ha dado una, una hermosa familia. God has blessed me with a place that I can call home. Con un lugar donde puedo llamar casa. And even with families and friends that I can, uh, friends that I can call my family. Y con, con personas que puedo llamar y and amigos que puedo llamar mi familia. That is because I have sown a seed of tithing. Es porque yo he sembrado una semilla de tierra. That has been sacrificial unto God. Because I understood that principle. That what I have belongs to Him. So I ask you today. To test God in this. And I promise you. That He's going to come through. And He will supply. In due time. Todo, todo lo que Just like that soil Así como la tierra, that needs that nourishment, que, que necesita ese mantenimiento, that needs the light, que necesita la luz, the water, la, el agua. the Lord is asking you to tithe el Señor te está so que that siembres, he can start sowing in your life para que él, para que él pueda en tu vida. so he can start nourishing your life para que él, de mantenimiento en tu vida. So he can start watering your lives. Para que él le, le eche agua a tu vida. So that you can grow. Para que tú crezcas. In that good soil. En esa, en esa tierra fértil. And not be in the highway. What is it called? Wayside. Wayside. Y no estar en la en la tierra plana. Or thorny soil. O, o la tierra con Or espina. bad soil. O, o la tierra que But no be es in mal. that good soil with the Lord. Pero que estén en, en la, una tierra fértil. So. If you guys see up in the screen, we have the, um, what do you call that? QR code. I'm learning. QR code, you guys can give through Cash App, Zelle, and Venmo. Just take a picture, scan it, and it will take you straight to where you need to give your tithes and offerings, or offerings. And I have Jake over here. Aquí tenemos a Jake. Who also has envelopes if you want to give through cash or check. Si quiere dar por sobre en efectivo. Just raise your hands. Solo levanta la mano. And you will be supplied y tú, with envelopes. Y tú será dado sobres. So we just want to thank you guys for coming today. We're going to pray now. Le queremos dar gracias a todos por venir. And we're going to ask the parents to please do not forget your children. Who are in the school <laughs> back there? No, no sus hijos. <laughs> Show your tags. Eh, tu, su, su tag. tu etiqueta. Ah, and su we will dismiss your child accordingly. Y le vamos a dar sus hijos. So, Father, we just thank you in the Sabbath. We present the tithes and offerings before you. We ask you, Holy Spirit, that you may speak to us every single day, Lord, as we seek your presence, as we seek your word, Lord God, as we seek for answers, Lord, to the questions that we have in our lives, my Lord. Father, I pray that you may bless every sower in this day, my Lord God. Every person, Lord God, who has entrusted, Lord, their soul unto you, their lives unto you, Lord God, in a form 
form of tithing, my Lord God, in a form of offering, my Lord God. And I ask you that you may bless them in this hour, Lord God, that just as you bless us, Lord God, you will bless us tenfold, a hundredfold, Lord God. I pray, Lord God, that you, Lord God, may show to us and reveal to us, Lord, that you are the God of the silver, the God of the gold, my Lord, the God that when we ask, Lord God, and we seek you, Lord God, you will supply the needs in our lives, my Lord. Father, I pray that you may increase our faith in this day, Lord God. Increase our faith, my Lord, to trust you in this area of our lives, my Lord, of tithing, Lord God, of offering, Lord God, that even though we may feel that it is a sacrifice, my Lord, we know, Lord God, that it is going to be planted on good soil, Lord God, that will grow roots, Lord God, where we will never, Lord God, waver to the left or to the right, Lord God, but that we may move forward, Lord God, and focus on you and your calling and your purpose in our lives, Lord God. Hello. If you just finished watching this message and you have not received Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, I want to give you an opportunity to receive him in your heart. If you can just bow your head and pray with me. Father, we thank you. We bless you. Lord, I confess through my mouth that you are Lord, and I believe in my heart that God the Father raised you from the dead. Forgive me for my sins, and I thank you, Lord, for accepting me into your kingdom. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now, if you just pray that prayer with me, you are born again, and you have received Jesus into your heart. Now, if you can leave us a comment down below, if you can follow us on Facebook, Come Connect Church, uh, that'll be awesome. We want to be the first ones to say hello. Any prayer requests that you have, please leave us a message on our Facebook page, Come Connect Church. God bless you. I'll see you on our next broadcast.